and last year, the whole United Kingdom has been engaged in a great national effort to fight COVID, already under extreme measures. It's clear that we need to do more together. In England, we must therefore go into a national lockdown which is tough enough to contain this variant. That means the government is once again instructing you to stay at home. We're also telling nightclubs, theatres, cinemas, gyms and leisure centres to close on the same uh, timescale. So, gyms have closed again. Not very ideal, especially for those like me who went to the gym frequently and had a real passion for it. Of course, I'm not the only person who felt this way, so I went and asked a few people and this is how they felt about it. When gyms were open, did you go? And if so, was it regularly? Yeah, when the gyms were open, I went, I was going about four, sometimes five times a week. Just, yeah, man, I was going about four or five times a week. I went to the gym probably four or five times a week. Yeah, I went to three times a week and then the rest of the time I did home workouts and then I had to, obviously I had two rest days. Yeah, we did, yeah. When gyms open, yeah, I did went to the gym, yeah. Uh, how did you feel when they kept closing? Um, very frustrated because obviously I'm you know, I'm trying to um, become a professional strongman, so any kind of interruption to my training is very frustrating. Um, if you miss training sessions or you your training is interrupted at any point, then you lose a lot of progress. So yeah, frustrating is probably the biggest word that I would use. I felt pretty sad because obviously gym gives people a focus and without that they might get distracted or not feel as happy in themselves. Uh, I was mixed feelings, like for one, like there's something taken away from us, so inside me I was a bit pissed. However, this gives us more chance to work on ourselves while well, we have more time off. So. Uh, it was frustrating because you'd see a little bit of progress, you know, you start a routine or you'd be in a routine and then when the gyms were closing, they were just interrupting it. So you either missing out on your games or your routine was broken. So very, very frustrating, can't lie. In general, physical health consists of diet, exercise and lifestyle. Exercise is one of particular importance and has been the one most greatly affected by the lockdown. Has it affected your mental health? Um, I think it has. Obviously I don't have gym as a focus anymore, so it hasn't been, so home workouts haven't been as fulfilling as gym. Uh, for me, not much. I found that my days have been quite boring without it, but at least got my mates to work with. So it's, a, it's okay. The first time, yes, I'm not gonna lie, it was it was a bit tough. Like going to the gym is fun. I see my friends there, I meet people there, but when they close, it was tough. But second time round. Not, not so much, not really. What a lot of people might not be aware of is the effect that exercise can have on a person's mental health. Firstly, exercise is proven to greatly reduce day-to-day -day stress, increase self-reported happiness levels, and lower levels of sadness and loneliness, both in the short term and long term. These answers clearly demonstrate that gyms play a big part in people's lives, including their physical and mental health. So as we're coming close to a year since this pandemic started, let's hope that the finishing line is in sight.